Hey everyone, it's Gary the Google Guy here. I thought I'd let you in on a new update to Google Sheets, and that is going to be in regards to adding images to cells. So one of the cool pieces here, unlike previously when you could add images into cells, is that images inside cells now will be associated with a row and move along with that data. So if you move rows, filter or sort them, the images will move with the content in the row, unlike previously. So let's go ahead and show you how to do this. We're going to click into our cell here to the left of Docs, Insert menu at the top, Image down below. We're going to do Image in Cell. Now you can also do Image over Cells, which behaves pretty much like it used to where it would sit over the grid. It wouldn't actually sit inside of a cell. So Image in Cell, we're going to go to our Upload piece here and we're going to actually add the Docs one. So I'm going to grab my Docs icon and we're going to drag and drop that in there as my Upload. You can also grab things from Drive and do a web search if needed. And you'll see it's added my image into our cell here. You want to make the image a little bit bigger, you're going to have to make your cell a little bit larger. So once again, that's you select your cell, go to Insert, Image in the menu, Image in Cell, find your file, whether it's an upload from Drive or otherwise. Let me find my sheets icon and we'll drag and drop, uploads, and puts it into that cell. Now another thing that you can do, and I know I have some other clients that are going to love this piece, is that we can add an image to a cell maybe at the very top and then have all of our information underneath that. We can go to insert image and we'll do image in cell and this time we will go to our folder and we're gonna back out of this folder just a little bit and let's find a file here drag and drop and you'll see it's added my image let's go ahead and center that image and then let's make this a little bit bigger so I'm gonna just make my row a little larger and now I can make my column a little bit larger and you'll see that it'll fit appropriately to whatever I want and then maybe I put my data underneath that. So another really helpful update to Google Drive and specifically to Google Sheets of being able to insert images into cells. Until we meet again, another time, another update. This is Gary the Google Guy signing off.